Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back for a brand new video. So for today's video I've done a little spend the day with me vlog. I feel like I've not done like a, just a single spend the day with me vlog in ages and you guys seem to love them so that's what we're doing today. So we went on like a little shopping date day, like a Saturday date day. Weren't really shopping for anything specific, just went out, had a look around. Nando's date, I had to pick up my ring that my dad got me. I got it engraved and it says old man on the inside now, I don't know if you have to see. I don't know if you can tell, but it says old man there, which is what I call my dad, so. Got that engraved on there, which is really cute. And then we just had like a cute little random Saturday date day. While we was out shopping, I did some Mother's Day shopping because you can never be too prepared for Mother's Day. I always leave things last minute and I'm like, regrets, because everything's always sold out. With Mother's Day coming up, I thought I'd give you like a little mini gift guide for what you can get your mum for Mother's Day. First of all, I've picked her up some straighteners because my mum needs a good pair of straighteners, so I've got these blue ones. If you've got like the hardest mum in the world to buy for, Good skincare is a must because I don't know a single mom that doesn't like skincare. Or even if you just want to treat yourself, if you're like getting a little bit older, you're worried about your skin aging and stuff like that, you need to invest in some good quality skincare, but that's not going to break the bank. I've got some products here from Nivea Q10, which I know my mom is going to love. She loves like anti-wrinkle creams and stuff like that. So obviously I had to pick her up some of those Mother's Day. There was one specific product that I was after because she has mentioned this before and I was like need to get that for mother's day and it's this this is the nivea q10 power firming day cream and visibly firm skin and reduces wrinkles in seven days this is effective on three kinds of wrinkles so it's forehead wrinkles crow's feet and then like the mouth and cheek area as well so i know my mom's gonna love this and it also says it protects against uva and uvb rays causing premature skin aging so there you go mom that's what you was after i've got it and then i did also pick up some other bits from the nivea q10 range so we've got the revitalizing night cream as well so she got a firming day cream revitalizing night cream and then i also got her the firming eye cream and then everyone loves a little face mask we've got the firming sheet mask as well this is suitable for all skin types and i already know my mom is going to be so grateful for these on mother's day so if there's someone in your life that loves a little bit of skincare and they're getting older and want to protect their skin from wrinkles and stuff like that then this is such a great gift idea for Mother's Day. Or if you just want to treat someone in your life to something special, then this is such a good gift idea. But yeah, thank you to Nivea for sponsoring this section of the vlog. I'll leave all the links and stuff down below to these little bits. I kind of want to get these up in 25 this year. I feel like I kind of want to prevent before it happens. So I might have to invest in these. Mom, I'm kind of jealous that I'm giving these to you. And I also picked my mom up some of her favourite chocolates. So these are from Hotel Chocolat. She loves nutty chocolate. So I've got the nuts one the milk chocolate one and then she loves mint chocolate as well so i got a peppermint one and then i picked her up some essentials and if i'm with that essential skincare pajamas always a good option so i got these black fluffy slippers and this black pajama set from primar and then the last little thing that i got her was a candle and i feel like this is just like the perfect recipe for a cute mother's day present sorry if the angles just changed i did just knock my camera off my window ledge but that's my sign to get into the video so if you do enjoy give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and yeah let's get into the vlog the vlog has been ages since i've done a spend the day with me vlog but it's a saturday today oaks off work I'm going out into town to do some shopping i need to go and pick up my ring that my dad got mixed got it engraved and i'm just gonna have like a little walk around we're going for a nando's for lunch we're just gonna spend the day together because i've not done one of these in ages and i really miss filming vlogs i feel like i've been slacking on youtube so i'm sorry but we're back this is my little outfit very basic i'm trying to show you my outfit without exposing the ugly ugly kitchen because we're stripping it to have it done so please just ignore i'm wearing this gray jacket from prt it's like a little cropped hoodie white top from zara zara jacket these joggers are from pindy doll my nike sakai's and then a little chanel this is the outfit of the day we've been a slick bun top tip if you don't do this then you need to start doing this if you have a slick in your hair back like this then just slick it back with a hair mask it's just so much better for your hair than like gel and hairspray but yeah we need to go now it's like half nine heading into town do some shopping get some lunch and that is all. Hey, fluffy boy. On that hey, fluffy boy. Hey, handsome boy. I'm gonna miss you. I hold your hand. I'm gonna miss you. Can't wait to take him out when we get back. His Oaks outfit of the day. Fresh trackie that I got him. Come on. Sick trainers. Ready to go? I'm ready. Let's go. I'm gonna miss you, handsome boy. Yeah, First I can't stop. see it. It's not even sunny. <laughs> First stop is to go and pick up my ring. So we took it into this little, oh. the markets. Yeah, I've never been here. Here. It's kind of like, there's a lot going on. Is I'm not gonna film in there because I'm not sure, we'll have a look. Here we are, in the Birmingham markets, wow. <laughs> Oaks made some purchases. H&M is actually really good for good quality basics, isn't it? Yeah. Some sick things in there, we'll show you when we get back. I need to find out where they get their stuff. For no reason. Just ask it. <laughs> Oaks just said he'd like to see me in a pair of those. And then he said, Kim Kardashian wore them with Jockers. And I was like, bro. Yeah, <laughs> Shannon Mooney, Kim Kardashian. Prefer them ones, the khaki ones. Well, yeah, same thing. 
I just tore one of them. I've just been smelling all these perfumes that came in to see if they had amber fusion and they don't. But um, yeah, I don't really like any of these ones either. I'm gonna be proud of me. We just walked into Zara and out of Zara and I made no purchases. And Oak showed me some cargoes that he liked. And I was like, stop encouraging me to buy clothes that I don't need. I've only discovered today that Oak knows what Axe Larigatos are. And he hates these. He said they look like lost property shoes. But these ones are actually kind of cute. But I really like these. I need a new like white pair of trainers. I like the chunky sole on the off whites. So we've come into the Adenola section. I wanted to try like a hoodie or something because they're meant to be like really good quality, but obviously they were way sold out and they are sold out. But what I've found is this. It's like a little uni tart, so I'm gonna try this one because I love a uni tart, but they've only got a size small, so I don't know if it's gonna fit. But yeah, let's try it on. I think I'd need a medium. It's cute, ignore the period pants by the way. But it's so tight, like at the top of my legs, it's borderline like digging in. I think this is a nine. It's cute though, it's just very tight and I couldn't dip it up myself even at the back, but it's cute, but it's just too small. All our shopping is done and now we've gone for Nando's. I feel like I haven't had Nando's, actually that's a lot. I've had ages, but I have them in Scotland. But we've just went to um, Super Drug because we needed some hairspray. Got these things. I didn't think they were chewing them, and I still don't know if they are or not. I just said chew for at least 20 minutes. They don't look like chewing gum. They're Would it say chew for 20 minutes if you're not gonna if you're gonna be able to eat them? It says just says chew for at least 20 minutes though. It doesn't say don't swallow. So I don't know. If anyone knows, are they chewing gum or not? I don't know. Order some halloumi, and then I've got my usual chicken pit out for mash. I'm very cheap. I'm so excited. I've got halloumi to start. I love Nando's and Yumi. I don't like chili jam, but Nando's and Yumi is elite. Food's here. I was about to ask Mom about coleslaw, so I'm just to scrape it all out. But I've got mashed curry chips and a chicken pita and oats done healthy on me. So it's got broccoli and spicy rice. Also a hack if you like the garlic, no, peri, what's it called? Peri mayo, peri nays. Don't pay for it, just get normal mayo and mix your sauce into it and it looks really nice. Shopping's done. All I bought for myself was a lip gloss and some mini car mixes and some tropical extra whatever they are. Oak secured some goods in H&M. I did indeed, man. And now we're going home to Cobes. We've literally just always spoke about since being out is how much we miss Cobes and want to get home. <laughs> in his Instagram in Nando's. Oh, and my this. lock screen. I haven't even showed you my lock screen yet. Is that not an actual bear? But now we're going to go home. It's 20 past one. Nando's is a good Nando's as well, by the way. I forgot yeah. to ask for no salad. I'm a fucking pit of bread, though, man. Good. Now we're going to get home and give Cobes a nice long walk. And then we've got. We're going right. Then we've got a cleaning evening. Yeah, what yeah. a wild Saturday night for these two adults. Whoa. Should we have a movie night later as well? Yeah. Fancy yeah. picking. Oh. My turn. No, it's not. You didn't watch Camp Rock. Oh, bro. You didn't watch. It's my turn, man. You, just let me pick. You didn't watch Camp Rock. You always just pick shit films, though, man. And that's crap. I've watched them before. Yeah, but you didn't watch Camp Boy. Rock with me. So it's my turn. I did watch Camp Rock. You didn't. You went to sleep. I watched Love Island with you. That's enough. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it I is. I watched Baptiste with you. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. You like Baptiste? Yeah, you like Love Island. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Don't bullshit. How yes, many Love Island? Do. No, I don't. No. Yes, you do. Bullshit. No, it's not bullshit. Nah, bullshit. You love the drums. You Stop hate rhyme like me. Stop the cap. <laughs> You're getting all in Paris. <laughs> what is a lot of Holland? <laughs> he just admitted it. <laughs> nah, nah, I don't like Love Island. You got me there. I didn't, I don't. <laughs> love Island's all right, okay. He likes a bit of Love Island. He loves a bit of the drums. He's not, Island. he's not Team Ron. The first like few episodes are shit. I hate Ron. Ron's a fucking... <laughs> Prick. Bellend. Will to win. And it... Will's fucking jokes, man. He is funny. Maybe we should go off topic then. <laughs> we're going home to Cobes. Oh yeah, we're going home to Cobes. Take him on a walk. Clean. Movie night. Hell yeah. Also, we need to play the Switch. I really yeah, want to get Animal Crossing we'll shoot at Mario, though. The only game we've got <laughs> we can play, yeah. Together. What the fuck's that bird doing? She's like hovering. It's Mario World and she's shit, I'm man. I'm so bad at it. You are so bad at that <laughs> game. It actually like gives me the ick how crap you are, Mario. Gives me the ick as well. It's died, bro. You I can't remember the last time you completed a level. <laughs> Neither can I. Like a baby. Anyways. <laughs> yeah. I wanna get Animal Crossing. So I'm gonna steal my sister's because she doesn't play it. Yeah. Peace out. Wiggly boy! Here's your wiggly! Get out wiggly boy! Get out wiggly boy!
Hello there. Hi, handsome boy. Hello. Hello, my big bear. Do you want to go on a walk? Should we go for a walk? Wanna go for a walk? Wanna go walkies? Wanna go for walkies? Come on then. Come on then. We love an afternoon walkies, don't we, Cobes? He's too cute. He's literally happiest when he's on his walks. Yeah. That's why he waits for all day. Yeah. We're home from our dog walk and now it's time to tackle the state that is my room. No matter how many times I tidy up, it's just spotless it right now. I'll have work to do tomorrow. And then it'll be trash. But to be fair, this is from when I did my TikTok live with Boohoo. It is still trash from then. But the state that it's in is so bad. Like, really, really bad. That bad that I don't even want to show you what it looks like. But I'm going to show you because I'm going to do a time lapse of me cleaning it. <laughs> How embarrassing. I'm going to spend probably the next hour in this room cleaning it up, tidying everything, sorting out all my stuff. I want to have a wardrobe sorted out as well. This is going to be me for the next however long it takes to so enjoy the time lapse. You know what it is? It's this mountain of clothes here. <laughs> it's triggering me. And it took way more than an hour, but she is clean. Them shoes, oak selling, that stuff is work stuff that I still need to do. But it's finally all clean and sorted out. It's now 10 to 7. I think me and Oak are going to have nachos for dinner. Let me go and ask him if that's what he wants. He wants to hear something gross that we've discovered. <laughs> Cobra is a very snotty boy. Our bedroom carpet's cream and there's all dots on it. Me and Oak were like, where are the dots coming from? What is that? We thought it was like from the vac. But being dirty and going on very the carpet. careful with it but there's fucking stains everywhere it's yeah. a joke I was like what is that and we've clocked that it's his snot it's you isn't it come is on it's it? one come on his snot up the walls come on confess to everybody I'm a snotty boy I'm a snotty <laughs> boy <laughs> hey darling it's alright you can be snotty if you want you can we yeah. love you snotting everywhere you can really you be as snotty as you want Fine by us. Do we need to get like. Do you want a treat for snotting everywhere? <laughs> <laughs> Give me a treat. Give me a treat. Give me a treat. Give me a treat for snotting everywhere. Give me like a treat. <laughs> oh. Oh. I think I know what this delivery is. Okay, let me have this first. <laughs> I ordered Cobes a rain jacket for daycare and I got a large and it was too small. So I've ordered an extra large. Right. So I can the extra fixing. Yeah, it's pretty easy now. <laughs> Look at this. Oak. <laughs> I'm gonna go and try it on him. Hello, you're about to hate me for doing this. Do you remember what we tried to do yesterday? Round two today. Leg please. Thank you. Thank you. Other leg please. Thank you. Where is it? In there. So he gets really like wet and dirty when he's at daycare. I don't want to have to keep buffing him. So we've opted for a little raincoat. Is that alright with you? And they only had a yellow and an XL. <laughs> Can I have your leg, please? Oh, I actually think this one's going to fit. And then... Oh, can't see, darling. I need your other leg. No, your arms are coming out. Put it back in. His hair's in the way. <laughs> what are we doing to you? Huh? What's mum doing to you? Oh, he looks so cute. Cobra, you look so cute. You look so <laughs> handsome. Oak. Come look at your boy. Oak is going to hate this. You look so handsome, eh? You're going to come home all fresh from daycare now? Huh? That's it. <laughs> That's perfect, isn't it? Perfect. <laughs> Looks like a bobblehead. He does. <laughs> Where's Dad? Cobes. Cobra. Cobra. Look at me. Cobes. <laughs> he just froze. He's been like for ages. Yeah. Cobes. Oh, nah, bro. Nah. <laughs> On a serious one. I don't want him to wear that. Why? Nah. He looks, <laughs> he looks cute. He 
You ain't wearing that combs, are you? You used to make her. Nah, bro, that shit. Combs, man. What is she doing to you? Go back. Nah, bro, he hates it. Oh, bless him, man. Hey, Bass, Miffies. Combs, what's this? <laughs> He's like, help me, Dad. Go back. That's enough now. As long as you promise to clean him. I will clean him, bro. I am not having him wear that. <laughs> That's awful. Okay, sorry, darling. Mom's you a not bitch, like it. Is. Coats, is mom a bitch? Do you know what? I'll save myself 30 pounds, so I'm not complaining. Mom's a bitch, isn't she? Is that 40 quid? Yeah. Fuck that. <sighs> Coats. These bitches ain't shit, mate. I'm telling you. <laughs> Fine, it's going back. <laughs> hate that one, yeah. <laughs> We're having our dinner. The dinner is these. Dorito dippers. They're smoked paprika. They're basically just like nachos. And then, you actually need to try this if you haven't tried this for a dinner. It's really nice. We get this cheese, but you can get like the Dorito cheese. You can get Asda's cheese, whatever supermarket you go to. I'm guessing they do a cheese in it. Yeah. We got it. If it's in a glass jar, put this in the microwave, stir it, put it back in. Warm cheese. And then Oak has jalapenos with his. I've run out of them, man. Run out of jealous? Yeah, that's, oh, no. that's all that's left there. No. Pissed. Not good enough. This is our dinner. This is our substitute takeaway dinner. Oh no, it came into my room early and he's like, it feels weird not having takeaway on a Saturday. And we kind of looked at each other and just say, should we get takeaway? <laughs> but we was like, no. No. But we had a big lunch. So I'm not hungry for a big, big dinner. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You don't know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm going to tomorrow. You're going to cook it? Yeah. Okay then. I've mastered the jerk chicken. Cleaning's finally done. I hate cleaning. I hate being an adult. It's the worst, man. I need to it's done now. The house feels fresh. And now mm. we can chill. It's now suddenly 11pm. So after nachos, we just chilled really out. Upstairs sorting out all the clothes for vintage. So Oak basically just looks after all the vintage stuff for me. And I've been down here editing, working away on this Saturday night. Oh, my laptop's literally just died. That is so annoying. But I've just basically edited a vlog for tomorrow. And now it's time for bed, to be honest. It's 11 o'clock and I'm tired. If we actually left him, he would fully, happily sleep outside. You coming in? It's bedtime. You come in. Come on, then. Come on. In. You literally have to, like, force him to go in. Bedtime. Good time. Hello, Mr. Bear. So this is what Oak's been sorting out. All of these bags of cloves are going on my vintage. My vintage is, what's my vintage name? It's just your name, bro. Oh, it's just at Shana Mooney. Yep. Easy, at Shana Mooney. All of this stuff will be uploaded at some point. That is Oak's new job. You're going to help him? Thanks, Cobes. You're going to help Dad? Yeah, thank you. You're going to sort it all out and you're going to pack, pack the parcels. Yeah, you're going to kiss him. Seal it with a kiss. Love from Cobra Smith. Look guys, one ear's... Well, it's still got a little fold on the end. Cobra, look, what's this? But this one's still very floppy. That one's almost up. You are so handsome. You are so you are. handsome. Mm-hmm. Ready for bed? Oh, should we show the snot marks? You see all these little dots in the carpet? Snot marks. Snot marks from a snotty boy, Cobra. Snotty, was that you? Was that you? Oh. What? Mm. Oh, it ruined his new jumper that I got him for Christmas. He was using like a spray that had bleach in it. Mm -hmm. And now he's bleached his jumper. Great. <laughs> kind of rude. The lighting's not very great, but Cobra's has just jumped up on our bed and lied down. I know it's making him move, kind of mean. <laughs> if I was you, I'd sleep on the floor. Just saying. Look. <laughs> Those jokes. I'm sure they're right about that now for fever. Oak is not okay. Look, Hope is on our bed. Oh, look at the tail go. Whenever we speak to him, his tail's like, oh my god. I've got Oak's two pack t shirt on. The bun's coming out. My bun that tight, they literally give me a headache, so. This needs to come out. Freedom. Oh, Kerb is about to the camera. Oh my god, that feels. So nice. Doesn't look great, but it feels 10 10. I feel free. I'm gonna wash my hair tomorrow. Oh, would you ask to pass my tea, please? Where is it? There on the right here. 
Oh, what such a headache from that bun. Thank you. It's my first tea of the day. Can you actually believe it? I look disgusting right now. Mmm. Happiness in a cup. Right, I'm gonna end the vlog here because it's probably about half eleven now. Cobes is asleep on the floor. He's moved off the bed. Oak's about to get into bed. My bubble's out, which means I'm ready for bed. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this spend the day with me. I feel like I've not done the spend the day with me in ages. And I need to get back on my YouTube game, bro. Do you know I haven't uploaded this week on YouTube? You're a slacker. Oh no, so bad. What are you playing at? It's just I've been a busy week. Why are you playing it? But I'm going to get back on it, I promise. But I'm going to end this video here, so thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe. Any videos you want to see, let me know. And if you want more daily vlogs, let me know and I'll do them. But yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys very soon in the brand new video.